What is up guys and welcome back. So for today we have yet another Mortal Kombat 11 video and for today's video we seem to have the voice actors possibly confirming either a Combat Pack 3 or just some type of new content for MK11. But anyways before we get into any of that, like always be sure to smash the subscribe button if you haven't already. So with that being said let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so I'm sure a lot of you already know about this but there is one more that you probably didn't know about. So let me just get this out of the way. So I'm sure you have all seen this, right? which is the post by the Johnny Cage voice actor, which shows him saying it's good to be back. And this was posted like uh, just over a week ago. And as you can see, he's at the Warner Bros. Studios. And a lot of people are like, oh, he's probably recording something like new voice lines for Johnny Cage or who knows, right? Well, a lot of people shut that down pretty quickly, even though there is even more proof that he might be back for something related to MK11. And the biggest proof is this right here so you might be like who, who even is this guy right well for anyone who doesn't know this is the uh liu kang and fujin i believe a voice actor i'm pretty sure he voiced both of them and as you can see he posted this image also about like i think this one was like only three days ago and it says finally back in the booth at the warner bros audio underground so great to do my craft out in the world again and you might be like, okay, so how's that? How, like, besides him being the voice actor for Liu Kang and Fujin, how do we know that's MK11 related, right? Well, if you click on more right at the end of his caption, guess what we see? This right here, which as you can see, has hashtags, but more importantly, the, the fifth hashtag, MK11, guys. Hashtag MK11. It is, it is a fifth hashtag there, which completely confirms there is some type of relation to MK11 or he could have just done it since he's known for being in MK11 but I can't imagine him randomly just putting MK11 just because he has previously worked on the game. I'm pretty sure he's out there for something MK11 related. I mean like I said he's I, as you can see he straight up put hashtag MK11 in the hashtags of what he wrote to be back at the Warner Bros booth to record again like come on this has to be something and guys I am so tired of waiting we are literally going on to eight months with no DLC so whatever happens I just hope it gets announced soon I mean clearly he's at the at the Warner Bros studio the Johnny Cage voice actors at the Warner Bros studios like something has to be happening and I know some people actually think that maybe the voice actors are coming back to record something for the next game, whether it's Injustice 3 or some Mortal Kombat spin-off game, we don't know. And that could definitely be the case, but just the fact that he put hashtag MK11 kind of narrows it down strictly to MK11. So like I said, guys, I'm just tired of waiting. Let's hope we get something soon. But regardless, I wanna know what you guys think about this. Let me know all your thoughts and opinions on all of this in the comment section down below. And for now, let's get to the comments of the day. So first up we have, I love seeing all the idiots here that believe that Combat Pack 3 will release. That, that's pretty damn harsh. I saw it and I low-key felt offended, but I was like, you know what? At the same time, you look at the facts and he's kind of saying the truth. Like, dude, eight months, the better half of a year with no DLC. Like, how, like at this point, we're going to be waiting three years and still be like, yeah, guys, Combat Pack 3 coming 2026. Like, come on, guys. There's no way, like... It, there's a high chance it's done. I just really hope that whatever, if something's going on right now, which it looks that way, because these voice actors are coming back, I just hope it gets announced like literally right now. Like how much longer are they trying to keep us waiting, guys? I don't know. Next up we have, I wouldn't be mad at Ed Boon, LOL. It's just a joke about MK versus Marvel. It's just a fact that people can't take a joke. So this guy's referring to the uh, tweet that I actually made a video about by Ed Boon which said uh, he mentioned an upcoming Mortal Kombat versus Marvel game. And a lot of people, including myself, think that it would be pretty messed up if he is just joking because he's getting a lot of people hopes up. That's like saying, yeah, guys, Injustice 3, and then saying, yeah, I was just lying about that. So a lot of people are like, oh, it's just a joke. Take a joke. Okay, guys, there's nothing funny about that, though. Like, I'll, I know how to take a joke. But saying, hey, our upcoming game is Mortal Kombat versus Marvel, I, I really don't, I don't, I don't know where's the funny part about that. I mean, unless he's just trying to like, like you know, like make us look like like stupid. Okay, sure, but 
saying, hey guys, this is for our upcoming Mortal Kombat vs. Marvel game, just for me, lacks any type of humor. I, I can't believe someone laughing at that. Like, I don't think it was funny in any way. If you think it was funny, then you could probably got some weird humor. But, yeah, Ed Boon did say the upcoming game is Mortal Kombat vs. Marvel. Was he lying? Maybe. And it would be pretty messed up if he was, because I saw so many people that were really excited for it, actually. So, in my opinion... Joke or not, it's still pretty messed up because he's saying he's getting a lot of people hopes up for no reason at all. Like I said, it's like if they say, oh guys, Injustice 3 is, is coming out next year. And then they're like, oh, I'm just kidding. Or hey, Mortal Kombat 12 uh, coming out 2023. And then it's like, yeah, I'm just kidding. Like, Or even Combat Pack 3, guys, yeah, it's coming out in two months. And then they come out and say, oh, we're just kidding. Like, I don't know. It just it seems pretty messed up getting people's hopes up. And lastly, we have... Omni-Man for MK12 confirmed. Dude, I wish. I, I don't know if there actually will be an MK12 or if they're just going to reboot the whole Mortal Kombat video games. But regardless, in the next Mortal Kombat game or just the next game in general, whether it's a Marvel game, Injustice 3, I really hope we get some really dope guest characters. And yes, Omni-Man would be a perfect one in my opinion. But anyway, guys, that will be it for today's video. Like always, let me know all your thoughts and opinions on this in the comment section down below. Be sure to stay subscribed for more videos just like this one. Thank you for watching and peace.